Hello, it's Sheila from the Libraries and I'd like to make something with you today. And today we are going to be making some superhero clothes pegs. So we're going to need a few things. We're going to be needing some clothes pegs. So just ones like this, uh, like the crocodile type. Uh, we're going to be needing some coloured papers as well. So just the usual types of coloured papers or cereal boxes, anything like that. Uh, we're going to be needing a little bit of glue and some scissors. So I've got some to show you. I think these guys are absolutely brilliant. They are so simple to make. And I've made a few. So I've made a red one, a blue one. I've also got a bright yellow one here as well. And you can use them for lots of different things. So if you're anything like me, I like keeping all my little scraps of paper you can just put a little clip in them like that at the top and your superhero can hold on to your bits of paper for you um, or anything else that you think of you can use your superhero clips for so we're going to be making a green one so we i've got um the peg at the ready and we're going to cut out a cape because as you know all superheroes have a cape so we need a triangular shape like that. And the easiest thing to do is just start off with a piece of paper like that, fold it over so you get the center. And the it's going to be the length of it is going to fit exactly the length of the peg. So just take your peg and cut out an oblong like that. And then all you're going to do now is, so you can see your fold, you're just gonna cut down to either corner like that so we've got one side and then on the other so from the tip to the corner so like that so that's going to be our cape and we are just going to glue that on to the back of our peg now I've put a little bit of double-sided tape on mine already just to make it nice and quick and easy um, but you could just put some glue on it and you're just going to take your cape and stick that on the back. Let me just check. Yep, that's looking about the centre. I've already put, you might have noticed, a little smile on here because all my guys have got little smiles. There we go, like that. So I just took a felt tip pen and just drew a little smile on it. You might not want a smile. You might want somebody making a really angry face or a big happy smiley face. So you decide what kind of face you want. And as well as that, we're going to make a mask because as well as a cape, all superheroes have got masks. Now, um, we just need a tiny little piece because if we have a look at this one here, so we're just needing it slightly wider uh, than your peg and I've cut one out already and I've, whoops, mine's jumping around. I've drawn on it so you can see that um, the mask, oops, that's upside down. I've drawn on a tiny little mask and again, I've got some double sided sticky tape but you can just use glue for yours and I'm just going to remove that. Hopefully, it's going to come off slightly fiddly. Let's just see. Yep, there we are. So that's come off. And just going to place that over there like that. And that is our superhero clothes pegs. Guys, so... So say I've done, I've now done four because I love these so much. So I'm going to use them um, to hold all my little craft bits and pieces together because I end up with lots of little bits like this. I think, oh, do you know what? I'm sure I'll be able to think of something. And these little guys are just brilliant just for holding all of those little bits together. So that's what I'm going to use mine for. Have to think about what you want to use yours for. Happy making and I'll see you all soon. Bye for now.